Hi, I'm Justin Reynolds, author of Opposite of Always, and here are some fun facts about me. When my sister and I were younger, uh, we used to film our own uh, food cooking show, and we'd whip up these concoctions all the while talking to our studio audience, of course, that didn't exist, and then we'd force feed our parents our concoctions, which were largely inedible. And when I say that we used to do this when we were younger, also, I mean, uh, like maybe last Thursday. When I was 19, uh, one of my jobs was, uh, I was a pest control operator, and so on the very first night of the job, I was going out with uh, the senior operator, and we just unloaded our, our cargo van, and then we look over our shoulder, and of course, a rat the size of an overfed cat jumps into the back of the van. So I try to get this this uh, this rat out, out the back of the van, and so it leaps out at me, and uh, to this day, I am terrified of astral vans. Of course, rats too. I was uh, playing football on the opening kickoff. I get the ball, I'm running, uh, and I get through the crowd. I haven't even been touched, and then all of a sudden I feel a pop, and it turns out that I broke a piece of my hip. But I did score the touchdown, which is the important thing. Uh, totally worth the 12 weeks of crutches. I was a uh, NASA intern of the year, which was awesome, but then I promptly quit engineering altogether because apparently I wanted to be an English major and eat ramen noodle my entire life. But hey, uh, books, right? So cool. I come from a large family. Both of my parents have eight siblings each, which would make you believe that they in turn would want to have a large family, but nope, just my sister and I, which I think it says a lot about how much work it was to raise my sister. My family is ultra competitive. So much in fact that once we stopped watching the Super Bowl all together so that we could take turns typing a paragraph to see who was the best and most efficient typist. In other words, do not come to our parties. So once upon a time, I belonged uh, in a boy band that was named Jet, which stood for Justin, Eric, and Tony. We even made our own music videos, which essentially uh, involved uh, shooting uh, videos and in random locations, uh, such as in stairwells, uh, out in the snow on a swing set, uh, standing in front of a, a pool table. And I'm convinced that it had YouTube existed back then, the group would have been huge. <laughs>